it occurs to me that I do a lot of like more channel update videos than I probably should for a channel that doesn't really have a lot of uh, and you know it's not as, as a, a channel that's small as mine but you know I, that's, that's what I do hello everybody this is the one nerd and uh, just doing a little channel update video um, I know it's not unheard of me to just not come out with content for a little bit um, you know, I'm pretty delayed in a lot of the stuff that I do, be it reviews or all the other exciting content I say that I'm going to have on the channel. It ends up just being nothing. <laughs> uh, but there's a lot of reason for that, and I want to go over that uh, right now if I can. Um, I've had some changes uh, that have happened uh, recently in my life, as have we all. But they've all kind of... Um, shown that I really need to make a change. Obviously, right now we've got the uh, COVID-19 stuff going on and people are uh, at home more often. And I have actually the, um, the privilege of working in a, uh, in a place that allows me to work from home. So at the moment, I am working from home. And it's not a, it's not a surprise that my living situation right now is not ideal. Uh, I do uh, still live at home, shall we say. Uh, but that's going to be changing. As you can probably tell, uh, I am going to be moving in a week. About a week from now is when I'm going to be moving. And this whole month has just been kind of just the, the, the stresses of... Oh, this month and last month has just been the stresses of uh, working from home, getting everything set up for the work at home, and also getting everything set up to... Uh, move out, you know, finding a place, um, securing it, uh, paying for all the stuff that I needed to pay for that, and just starting the uh, starting the pack, which I have done. So I packed everything up, uh, my all of my uh, stuff that you you know see in the background, my recording equipment uh, for that has been packed up, and so I have not, and just all the other stuff that I've had to do, you know, just work from home, the stresses, being at home. Obviously, I usually like to record stuff, be it uh, audiobooks, be it reviews, be it anything else, uh, when my uh, when my parents are not here, so I don't, you know, disturb them or I don't get their ambient noises, uh, you know, in the background of my videos. Uh, but, so, since they've been home more often, I haven't been able, they've been home all the time, I haven't been able to find any free time in order to uh, record any stuff so that's why that hasn't been going on and I do apologize for that I know that it's been a while since I've come out with a uh, new uh, light novel edition for My Hero Academia uh, especially since we're so close to finishing volume two and I've got two more volumes to do which is just embarrassing I should be on volume four right now but I honestly I should be moving on to other stuff but that brings me to the next part of this which I think will be uh, exciting with me having my own place now and having a more uh, independent uh, place for me to do stuff that gives me more of an opportunity to uh, record uh, more content and more videos with having that space that freedom to be able to do that this has been something that I've always wanted to do and I've always felt that would help me out once I finally move out and just being at home and having the resources uh, that I've gotten because I've been working more overtime working at home and what have you that give me those resources that I needed uh, to be able to uh, to move out because you know when you move out you do need some you know starting cash in order to do like first and last months for rent and moving expenses and uh, just wanting to get comfortable in the first couple months to be able to pay for first couple months rent so that you'll be comfortable um, and that's what I've been able to do now uh, so that's that is why I uh, have those resources and I'm moving out again in a week uh, got everything packed up have the movers coming uh, next week in order to move everything out and once I do that I'm, I'm honestly planning on doing a you know a vlog style video if anyone you know really cares to see it of me uh, moving into my new place and unboxing uh, all of my stuff, you know, just to kind of see, you know, kind of see stuff in the background. I hope to show off more of that stuff in future videos when I do more reviews and unboxings of other stuff. But I feel as though there are some things that I can, you know, show off and make some, you know, video content if anyone is interested. And then once I'm done with that, then moving on to the actual content that I want to do. What does that mean uh, with the content moving forward? Obviously, light novel audiobooks. I'm going to be changing around the format of how I record light novel audiobooks instead of just doing 
uh, one chapter and then just editing, editing that together. What I'm planning on doing, what I want to do, is just take one day, one day off, and just record the whole thing, the whole book. Record the whole book, edit the whole book, probably not edit it in one day, but definitely record in one day. Uh, and then be able to come out with those uh, with those uh, sections once every two weeks or once every week. It just depends on what I what I can do editing wise. But I do plan on changing how I do uh, the light novel audiobooks once I start to get once I move and once I get into a place where I can start to record more independently. That's what I'm going to be doing, and that's going to give me an opportunity to do more light novel audiobooks, uh, not just for the remaining of uh, school briefs that I have to do, but also for the light novels of other stuff that I want to do. Like uh, I've I've always wanted to do Overlord uh, since Konosuba's ending. Uh, I do want to do a audiobook of that. Uh, Toradora is another one, and just a whole bunch of other uh, light novels that I feel that should have audiobooks, and I want to lend my uh, voice to that and ha give an opportunity for people to have that while also uh, wanting to support the uh, official release. Uh, after that, uh, obviously I do have some uh, scripts for a couple of reviews already planned out. Uh, already written. I just need to shoot the uh, the footage in my new uh, in my new place, and I want to do sort of uh, other reviews that aren't just you know about movies and TV shows. Uh, I also want to do other stuff like other people do. Like uh, John Tron just came out with a recent video about uh, the uh, Kid Nation, which was you know really interesting. I just want to do uh, stuff like that. You know, find obscure uh, things in media related to things that I like, like pro wrestling or maybe anime or what have you. I don't know, and just do you know little reviews on that. Kind of like uh, with um, uh, Brad Jones, Cinema Snob, doing like DVR uh, DVDR Hell, uh, stuff like that. It's just that's I do. I want to expand my content uh, more uh, than just those reviews because honestly, I try. One of the reviews I tried to do was of the um, the Ahsoka arc in the new Clone Wars season, and I was just watching it and I was just looking over it and I just had nothing to say about it. I mean, I think it's mediocre, but I really didn't find a need to like do a full on review of it. So I want to do less like negative reviews. Now, obviously I'm, I'm going to do negative reviews if I feel the need to like for different horror movies. Like I have a review of grudge that I want to do. Uh, and that's definitely going to be uh, good fodder for that. But I want to do other reviews like my power Rangers reviews and uh, holiday, the star Wars holiday special and Tim of the T-Rex and just do stuff that, that highlights it and not necessarily like uh you know tears it down or anything like just something that highlights something cool like what i want to remake the showcase into since i have canceled the showcase uh where i just show a full episode of a tv show that you know i don't own which was a bad idea from the start actually a funny story about that um i had planned on doing a showcase that involved uh, a Kiba ranger and I was just editing it, editing it together, and I just thought, you know what? Even though like no one's licensed it here, I would just be, and I'm, and I'm not monetizing it. I would still be using somebody else's work, like all those, like uh, the translators and the people who made the subs and what have you. Even if I linked it back to them, I would still be taking their work and putting it up on my channel, which is just not cool and especially now the common writer is uh licensed in america by shout factory it doesn't seem right to continue that in any kind of format so i've taken down all those videos and we'll do the showcase in sort of like a way to showcase things and talk about it so that you can and you know link it so that you can go see it and just uh see like weird obscure things that need more attention or even not obscure things but things that still need attention Along with that, uh, I will also be uh, doing more stuff that involves my own work and my own writing. Uh, I do plan on doing uh, some things that involve my scripts uh, with things like table reads, like a, like a one, either a one-man table read, or uh, I'm planning on maybe once I get more financially settled, maybe uh, commissioning some uh, internet voice actors and actresses and uh, internet artists to uh, create sort of a proof concept uh, for my works, be it uh, pilot scripts, uh, be it my spec scripts that I have, and just put that on, out, out on the internet to show, to sh sort of like eye-catching sort of things, because I want my scripts to get out there, I want to be seen as a writer and what I can do, and just putting my script out onto like my website or something like that is not 
eye-catching enough, you know, unless people like really know me and really want to, you know, listen to my stuff, you know, it's, it's just like, it's just some guy who puts his script down on the internet. Like, what's that? I just to sit here and read this script. That's boring. So I want to do some more proof of concept stuff where I do, again, uh, recruit uh, voice actors and actresses to do like a, a radio play version of my uh, TV scripts or something like that. And uh, again, proof of concept so I can have like uh, picture representations of different characters and scenes that I can do to really show off what these scripts have, like a little pitch, again, proof of concept sort of thing. And that's what I'm really excited about doing once I have the, uh, the resources and the space to do it. And that's what I want this channel to have more of, to have more of that stuff. Not just stuff, you know, that you'd expect, like, you know, of a channel like reviews and uh, re uh, reviews and unboxings and what have you, but stuff like that to really showcase what uh, makes me valuable towards that and what I want to bring to uh, the industry. I really appreciate you uh, watching this update video if you've gotten this far. Again, I do want to apologize to anyone who is waiting for uh, a new uh, version of my Light Not audiobook. Please, be, please rest assured that they are coming. Once I get done with this move, once I move out, you know, in a week, I'll get right to work because I'm taking some days off from work uh, when I move. I'm going to be taking some days off to, uh, you know, get settled. Uh, you know, get everything set up in my new uh, in my new apartment, and to work on that stuff, and that is what I'm going to be doing. Uh, again, I, I've said this before on other on other update videos that I I'm not in a position to ask you know too much of my of my audience because I've given them nothing to you know I've given them nothing at all. I, it's just been a constant thing of excuses and delays and uh, if I were a if, if I were watching just this I would come across my channel I would just think oh what is this guy doing he's taking too long you know what's he doing what's he what's he even do but I appreciate you sticking around I appreciate any new subscribers that I get again mostly from my light novel audiobooks I know nobody's coming here for the reviews but I still want to do them because I you know I like making them you know I like making all the stuff and including like random unboxing videos and I, I do have some unboxing videos uh, planned for stuff but it's weird when I get, I've always wanted to do some unboxings, but when I get the thing that I want to unbox, I just want to unbox it. I don't want to like wait and sit down in front of a camera. I just want to get it open and play with it or, or read it or do whatever. But I'm going to start, you know, doing more stuff. Again, this is all what this, what this update is about is saying that more content is coming, more consistent content is coming once I am done with all this. Once I'm done with this move, once I've moved out, once I'm out of here, you can expect more content from this. I just ask that you please be patient. If anyone has just subscribed, please be patient with me. I am uh, doing what I can. I've got ideas. I've got plans for the future. I just need to move out and then I can get down to the real brass tacks because right now, in this environment right now and in the position that I'm in right now, I've just... Honestly, I'm sluggish. I just don't have the motivation to do anything. Not to say that I, I feel like I'm rushing into this, but it's definitely time. It's, well, it's well past time for me to be doing this, but just expect more uh, update videos once I start to move, you know, to the progress of that and uh, sort of interesting things that I hope to do uh, with that that I hope you'll enjoy. I honestly do, because that's all I want from these videos is that for people to enjoy it uh, and to see me and possibly see my writing. Um, so I, I'm, I'm rambling now. Nobody's watching this anyway. Uh, this is the one nerd and especially in these times, I hope you have a good one. Hope you stay safe, stay healthy out there and, uh, I'll see you next time.